Over the course of his political career, Abdelaziz Bouteflika never shied away from reminding France of its colonial past. On the eve of his election in 1999, this was Bouteflika's response when Paris raised concerns that many parties were boycotting the vote. France pursued some very bad policies in Algeria, because when France arrived here, it saw vast empty space, an open playing field that it went on to use and abuse. Once elected, Bouteflika asked multiple times for France to admit its colonial wrongdoings. Still, when French diplomat Hubert Védrine visited Algiers in 2001, Bouteflika announced a new era of Franco-Algerian cooperation. But in 2003, when President Jacques Chirac wouldn't openly discuss France's colonial past, that bilateral friendship treaty ultimately went unsigned. Two years later, France sparked outcry in Algeria with a controversial law, referring to France's positive influence in North Africa. Chirac ultimately backtracked and revoked the offending clause. It wasn't until 2007 that a French president, Nicolas Sarkozy, publicly denounced colonialism. The colonial system was profoundly unjust and ran counter to the three founding principles of the French Republic. Liberty, equality and fraternity. That historic admission did not herald a new era of friendship. Following Sarkozy's visit, Algeria established a new national commission which sought to prosecute colonial crimes. François Hollande, like his predecessor, refused to apologize, but acknowledged the brutality of France's actions in Algeria. For 132 years, Algeria was subjected to a profoundly unjust and brutal system. This system has a name, colonization, and I recognize here the suffering that colonization inflicted on the Algerian people. It was a step forward, followed by a clumsy joke a year later. Our interior minister actually just returned from Algeria safe and sound, which is quite something. The arrival of Emmanuel Macron to power marked a new stage. While campaigning, this is how he responded to an Algerian journalist who asked him about colonization. It's a crime. It's a crime against humanity, a barbarity. And it's part of a past that we must confront by apologizing to those against whom we carried out these acts. Macron's words shocked the community of French people who had once lived in Algeria, but drew praise from many Algerians. Macron visited the country during his first year in office. I've come to turn a page for the future and for a new generation of Algerians that must look at France differently and also look at their own country's promises. In September of 2018, Macron recognized the French state's responsibility in the torture and death of mathematician Maurice Audin. The militant communist who fought for Algerian independence died in 1957 in the custody of the French army. The Algerian government welcomed the gesture as a positive step. It remains to be seen what direction French-Algerian relations will take now that Bouteflika is out of office.